All right, everybody. So I've kind of become a pretty big fan of uh, this guy named this guy John. He's uh, got the Tipsy Bartender channel on YouTube. He did a drink called Tiger's Blood. So uh, me and my buddy Dave here, we uh, happened to go out and get the products to, in order to make this drink because we really want to try it out. They, I feel, didn't do a great review, but they, you know, didn't like tomato juice, they don't like Bloody Marys, you know, things like that. Um, this is, uh, I guess, what they call very similar to a Bloody Maria, which is just like a Bloody Mary, but you substitute the vodka with tequila. Today we picked up a new tequila, and we just tried it a minute ago, chill. And honestly, it's not the most expensive tequila, but it's really, really good. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to do the chill shots. This is a shot. It's called Tiger's Blood. It's going to use the tomato juice, the tequila. We're going to do some hot sauce, Worcestershire sauce, lime juice, pepper, salt, and crushed red pepper. I have a feeling it's going to be a really bitey hot drink. <laughs> I, mean, I don't know about you, but I, uh, it's going to be bitey. I'm waiting for my lips to hurt. Um, so what? the first thing we're going to do, we have a little bit of the lime juice. We are missing one ingredient. Technically, it does call for celery salt. Celery salt. I didn't buy the celery salt. It was six bucks. That's just on a budget. On a budget. So, what we're, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna roll it in the lime juice. All right. Go ahead and do the room on that one. So, the, on this plate is crushed red pepper, black pepper, and salt. Um, I'm sure this probably really plays in with the, the taste of what the drink actually ends up being. And just remember, this is a shot. These are kind of large shot glasses. These are kind of a mix between a double shot glass and a low ball. Got some bite on the lip already? Yeah, it looks spicy. Okay, we're going to move these out of the way. And what we're going to do, we're going to come over here with our shaker. Get some ice in there. Twist her off the rocker, please. Alright, so it calls for two ounces. Okay, that's roughly a. Actually, here. If you have a trusty spout, I, I'm, I'm not a bartender, but I'm gonna guess I think it's probably around what, a three or four second pour? Good pour. Okay. There's the tequila. Calls for two ounces of tequila. And then what do we have next? Tomato juice. Alright. Sure that's pretty close. Okay, you want to do a hot sauce is a couple of two couple two, little two dashes. dashes. Two dashes. Okay, and then lemon juice or lime juice was so easy to add. I got a little bit more Worcestershire, more of that bitter. Okay, so then we got a pinch of that, pinch of this. Pinch of salt. I do cook, believe it or not, so we're going to do a pinch of salt. Of which a pinch, technically when you're talking about cooking, is almost a, you know, the, the center of your palm when you make it wrinkle. Yeah, about the size of a nickel. There you go. You must you must be able to cook too, sir. <laughs> We're gonna do the same thing with the pepper. About a nickel. Okay, so that's there, that's there. You got the salt, Worcestershire hot sauce, lime juice. Now it's all for the shake. Alright, let's get these over here. And again, these are fairly large shot glasses. But because the, the people who did the review on this, and I am a huge fan of his work, because they don't like Bloody Marys or tomato juice in general, I really want to do a better review because I love it. Dave loves it. We're going to do all this. Make sure the mix isn't perfect. We will perfect it eventually. We get the right idea, though. It, just, it okay. smells like it's going to hurt. It's good though. What did he right. say it tasted like? He said if you were to put your mouth onto a tiger's asshole, it sucked. That's what you get. Tiger's blood. But we like tomato juice, so. 
Yes, we do. All right, Thank arms you. up, sir. That is good. <laughs> Did you get some red pepper? <laughs> There's a lot of red pepper. <laughs> Yum. I, wow. Surprisingly, not as hard as I thought it'd be. What do you think, Dave? I enjoyed it. That was really good. Uh, the pepper on the rim of the glass, if you're not into the heat, do without that. Um, on that one, I mean, me personally, I would probably have done a little bit more of the hot sauce. Uh, technically, when they made it, they did tapatio, which is quite a bit hotter. Uh, we used Cholula hot sauce today, the original, which is kind of a pretty mild hot sauce. Very delicious, though. And uh, in my personal opinion, if you're a fan of Bloody Mary's, that was fucking amazing. What is Bloody Mary's vodka? This Bloody is Mary's here. vodka. So this would be a uh, spinoff of Bloody Maria. It's the same thing as Bloody Mary. Just with tequila instead of vodka. Personally, I enjoyed it. I, I think Dave enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, we're going to have another. Thanks, guys.